Ladies and gentlemen, for the 792nd time, it is the Mason and Friends show featuring that dude called Mike, a.k.a. Sir Chokes a Lot. Yeah. As well as his Junus, a.k.a. <clears throat> El Juperino. What up, bitches? Me. I am Mahoney. Welcome to the Mason and Friends show. What's happening, y'all? What's good out there today? So. Is that the Goonies? It is. It is. I'm trying to, like, I'm playing with volume. Man, these, these Zoom episodes get me every time trying to make it sound right. Mike, we're going to have to do this more as far as uh, testing is concerned. To try to get this bitch L proper for the future so we can have. Hey, that's what's up. Motherfuckers zooming in on this because this is close. But well, it ain't no cigar quite yet, but... What, what are you talking about, sir? What are you going to say? Oh, uh, look, so, uh... How I see that, uh... Y'all got y'all's first one, so congratulations to the Bears. Yeah, man, that was, um... That was a crazy game, man. Like, I forgot... Yeah, was there. Yeah, I forgot, like... I guess I'm getting old as fuck or just deaf, because I forgot how loud that motherfucking place was, man. Like... Both, both. Like, I had some. Deaf in one ear. Yeah, you old and deaf. He had some great ass seats. Like we was in like the hundreds, I think, or some shit like that. Like we was probably really like twenty rows back from the fucking field. From the goal line. Yeah, from the field. You know what I mean. So it was standing, oh, yeah, 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 standing yeah. the whole time if you wanted to watch anything. You know what I mean. And just home field, home side too. So I was about just about. One of five motherfuckers over there wearing Bears gear, you know what I mean? But just motherfuckers just just loud, just loud as fuck. And I'm like, wow, about like halfway through the fourth, man, I was just done, dog. Like, like I'm like, dude, when I and saw, I worked all day, you know what I mean? I'm like, yeah, right. I'm ready for bed. I like, knew, <laughs> I knew you were gonna be wiped out after that. I was like, man, a unit is gonna be completely worthless. For Friday, but I was getting wasted on the mall at fucking again tailgating at the I mall figured. is where it's at, bro. Tailgating at the mall is I where saw it's it on Instagram. at, bro. Like I'm telling you, dog. Like <laughs> shit, bro. Like when me and Jay was doing, we was on the bench and shit. That was another great time. And there's people everywhere. Here, it, this time it was a little laid back because they still got the mall kind of shut down. Uh huh. It's crazy. You still can't really access the mall fully like you could during Insurrection Day when they knew all about it. But for this fucking festival that happened a week and a half ago, they still got security locked the fuck down. Thank you, America. Appreciate you. Woo! Appreciate you, America. Hey, man, you know, you got to let a tragedy happen so you can clamp down the rights of people even But it's more. not really. It's just cops at every intersection just hanging out in a car, not letting people, like, uh. go anywhere, really. So the mall is not really live action like the mall usually is. Well, and things are going to be tighter for probably the next few weeks because of uh, what's going on in Israel right now. You know, by well, the time we, this we got episode, some more shit going on over there. Oh, bro, you are missing out, dog. I don't, like, I got, especially I got TV it's now or bro. radio, bro. It's like I don't listen to radio going to work because I just Pandora on the speaker because I'm in the truck, right? <laughs> so and then I don't, I ain't got the news because I ain't got TV. I was watching Arizona. The only news I watched was Arizona yesterday because I was streaming some fucking football game. And the game was in uh, fucking uh, Kentucky. And I'm all like, damn, it's, it's 97 out that bitch and they're wearing hoodies? And I'm like, hold up. And then me and Jay finally took me and Jay together. Our forces combined to figure out that that Cardinal was not fucking nowhere near Arizona. That was like the fucking Louisville or some shit. The Kentucky team you were or some watching. shit. I'm like, so why the fuck are they talking about Arizona out this motherfucker, bro? But it was like 97 last God, night in Arizona at 6 o'clock at night. I'm like, how in the fuck, bro? I'm not, I cannot be about that life, man. Because it was like 50 out this motherfucker yesterday about fucking it's been, 6 o'clock. It's been getting chilly now. Man, it's that time. It's fall. The leaves oh, yeah, are falling. Yeah. Harvest your plants, y'all, if you ain't done it already. That's outdoor weed right there. 
That's you grow it all outdoor, not in the tent. Yeah. Or not in the little tent junk. Yeah. You test it, you got the tester junk for nah, that? Nah, how you like it? It looks great, it's alright. Oh, thank you. It it's, looks it's, great, it's, it's alright. It looks right. great, it smokes weed, it smokes good. I ain't hitting the joint, but I mean a lot of shit. But it looks great. Yeah, it's pretty it smells wonderful. Smells good. I was just wondering what, because I know Velvet be testing this shit. I don't know what that yeah, all no, really entails and shit. You know I'd what love I mean? to, but I don't have the access. Or Because he said most weeds like 17 or some shit like that. 18, some <clears> shit <throat> like that. Real good weeds like 20, 20, 25 25. I'm like, what the yeah, fuck? Yeah, you can get can 25 Can you make like 30. 70 or something? Give me the 70, bro. That's what I need. I well, got, like, I need, I got problems with weeds, you know what I mean? That Tyson is a 30 plus. <laughs> yeah, I need drugs, yeah. But we, but we, but we, but he don't, drugs. he don't know what he wants. <laughs> you got any hundred percent weed? I need a hundred percent. Hey, yeah, man. I can't do the 17, bro. I need to go right to hundred. This says 30, but I, can 30? you give me the other 70? Yeah. I paid double. Where the 70 at? <laughs> <laughs> That's full stupid, man. Now look. All right, now hold on. Would uh, that be like using 10% of your brain? How you 100%? Uh, what's that movie with? Uh, nah, Lucy, you can't use over 7% of your brain, and then you're then you're flying and shit or whatever she's doing. Saying. Lucy was so taking over the world. 100% of weed. Imagine how high you'd be if you had 100% THC. Where I need to be. <laughs> where where I where, my level? You know what I'm screaming? That'd be uh, that'd be uh, my level. My shoulder no won't hurt no you more. The planet, bro. Nothing will hurt no more, bro. I'd be on my level, cuz. Cut. I'd be on my level, cut. All right, let's start at 69. All right, I won't go all the way to 100. So we want we want weed that ranges from 69% to yeah. 100% yeah. THC. Well, just under for the for the normal folk. We got normal folk weed. Normal folk weed it being at 20%, yeah. let's and then, call it. And then professionals. And what about unit and folk? Then, and that's, I got problem. 69 to 100 is yeah. I got problem. 69 to, to like 30 is for the, for the crazy folk or to just got their shit together. And then the 30 and under is just whatever. Y'all you'll just be started. fine. You'll be yeah, fine. Yeah, you'll be all right. Hit some of that 30. Get your granddad is edible. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> It's 30. You know what I mean? <laughs> Like back when we were young, there was like swag and mid. There was swag and, and there was combud. And when I started smoking, it was like right. combud and like midis and that Mexican dirt ass shit is all you had. And four way. Oh, I forgot. And four way. That's all you had. I grew a little bit of that. That's, <laughs> That's all you had. Yeah. The, the hydro, did I say hydro? Yeah, hydro, yeah. Yeah, I said hydro, but, yeah. But there was the hydro way. wasn't that hot though. But four way in that combo well, it was really just combo. Good weed was just combo, like the weed that had orange hairs and like was like worth yeah, smoking. That yeah. was just called combo, or Granddaddy Perp. <laughs> it wasn't until like eight years later well, see, that back then, everything. You, was every once in a while back then, you had some special shit come around. You like you jump on that. I remember mixing uh, uh, uh what was it? Some blueberry and strawberry haze, I think, together, and some white widow. The white widow had me munching out. Yeah, later. the white widow in the day was great. That granddaddy purple was great too. The granddaddy purple was pretty much the only weed, purple weed that I've smoked that I like. Like a purple weed, I don't really like purple weed. Like it just don't fuck me up as well. It slows it's you pretty, down it's because pretty, it's I think not it's, supposed to. I think it's an indica. I guess. I guess all purple weeds are indica. Maybe. It's supposed to lay your ass down. Yeah, you like that zero to hundred shit. I just like workable weed. Anything that puts you sativa. That yeah, sativa. I don't like getting high to take a nap. Anything that pushes, yeah, that puts your brakes on you. You don't like. Yeah, I don't like like getting high to take a nap. That don't make no sense. <laughs> I like getting high, dude. I like getting high, dude. But, 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 hold on. Get shit this done, weed. Will, uh -huh. This man will eat edibles and pass the fuck out. Hey, well, so, that's it's not look, always his intention. That's not my fault, bro, because, look, I, I've, I've dimpled and dandled in a lot of edibles of the same kind, too. And, and I, I, some of Fox shit, I guess, just hit different. I don't know. Cause that package had me in the paint, bro. But I've sat here and ate <laughs> one of them. Sometimes, fuck around at work times, I eat a cookie and half of one of them motherfuckers, and I'll be functionable. You know what I mean? But that one bag had me out. Like I didn't even drink. Like when I was at the Caps game, when I fell asleep, that jump, that fucking shit, that shit had me <laughs> fucking fucked up, bro. I don't know. I think it really comes from. 
the uh, strains that are being used in whatever the edible. Yeah, because is. he's just getting that pure extract shit, so it doesn't matter. I mean, it, it's all any, any kind of. I guess it's not a couple strains. It's probably just one solid. Oh right, I would suspect. Strand. I mean, you know, and but it's you, a jar. I don't even know what the fuck. It'd be like a whole twenty, like a whole cup full of fucking. Because I seen him the one time. He he was like, yeah, my boy just dropped all this good stuff off, getting ready for the. Uh, that was for the festival shit. He was like getting ready for all the festival. So he had a lot of that right, shit. Right, right, right. There's a lot of infusion going on. Yeah, there. but that shit looked delicious. I just wanted to just put my tongue in that joint, you know what I mean? Or just <laughs> double finger that joint like, <laughs> like, like uh, Winnie the Pooh. Right, right, right. I appreciate you. Face in the jaw. I don't need nothing no more. Because you, you can infuse honey too, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> you can infuse anything. But um, I don't know. I my boy got some sugar. I go up there like Winnie the Pooh. Excuse me, do you just have a. What's a jar of that honey? Uh-huh. I just want to put my tongue in the I just jar. want to put my tongue in that joint. Well, he does, a, a he does the what same thing. He thinks like Winnie the Pooh, so he got to <laughs> get to get to infuse honey <laughs> like Winnie the Pooh, too. Oh, fucking, that'd be, not, that'd be amazing. Yeah, I, I mean, they didn't infuse anything. Like, even Velvet infused fucking, like, fucking sugar. He has some oh, fucking you, sugar granules that was fucking, like, weed I, sugar. And I, I like, think that fuck? if you have, if you keep your bees exclusive to like a very large marijuana grow op that they will uh make honey with pollen off the weed off the or like yeah the trichomes off the weed i guess probably now that'd be interesting uh-huh. probably absolutely have a honey have a honey uh honey uh what do they call them when you have a colony of them motherfuckers like when you do your own a hive. hive yeah a hive yeah, but that's just one. That's just one. Like, what do you call when you got a flock of them up for? It's like the bee joint. Like, where the bee, do they call those anything? Or Swarm? Just... No, not with the bee. Colonies. Like, the beekeepers. Like, where they, where they have, like, 87 fucking boxes yeah, all together. What do they call colonies. that? That's just, yeah, a, that's just a colony. I think they're different colonies. Or a bee farm, I guess. Or yeah. A, bee. a beekeeper. You keep. But that's the guy, right? Colonies. The guy that keeps the thing, but I don't know what they call his, like, you know, um, menagerie of different bees. Because each bee has its own, what's like, he work for? He worked for a honey company or he worked for himself? I think he works for himself. Yeah, I believe so. I, like, companies have their own fucking farmers and shit like Big that. ones, I would think, yeah, but... Uh-huh. Not all these motherfuckers that are on the side of the road. Well, not on the side of the road, but, like, even that one dude down Mets got, like, 15, 17 fucking, like... Boxes out in the fucking side yards. Like, what are you doing all that yeah, shit? Yeah, but he's, that, that's for his, that's for the farm. Like, when you go into Messick's Farms or one of them country stores, they have their own brand of honey. Yeah, but the mess, that's Messick's growing that shit, that honey. Yeah, but they yeah. have boxes with bees that live in those boxes. If you build it right, you build it with, like, a tap on the side, and you go out and you literally just turn a knob, and honey comes out of the fucking joint. You don't have to open it up and disturb the bees. It'll like they'll fill it up with honey, and yeah, you can just go yeah, drain it drain out. It. Yeah, and then they'll fill it up with more honey. I wonder if my fuckers make any kind of money though. I don't know, bro. I think there's a lot of labor of love in that. There'll I don't be think, a lot of work in that. I don't think it's like something you get rich on. I think it's something you could break even or maybe make decent coin at, but it's a lot of work. I don't know. Maybe especially now, especially trying to keep them suckers healthy and shit. I mean, yeah, you know. especially with 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 all the all the sprays and shit that they be doing out here in these fields and. You know, you got to make sure you got your bees in a certain location and shit like that. It, it's a lot to go into it. Uh-huh. Man, oh, man. I swear to God, <laughs> that dude. For clear shit. He's so, I swear to God, if that was, I mean, it's amazing that y'all can have these things and not destroy them. Because I would, I would be thoroughly, thoroughly irked by them on a regular basis. But like, nah, look, you're going outside. You're not coming inside. Like, I, I would literally put them outside in the cold. If I get your jacket, go outside. I'm gonna let you in in an hour. Like, that's what I'm gonna do. Go occupy yourself. Read. Take a book. I take their phone and I put them, put them outside, dog. That's what I would do. I would be like, you want that old school? And they'd be like, no, daddy, don't give me the old school. And I'd be like, I'm gonna give you that old school, you little bastard. That's how you go punish them. Be like, you know what? Fuck that. I'm gonna whoop your ass. I'm gonna give you that old school. I'm gonna give you that old school. I ain't, I ain't beating your ass. I'm gonna make you live like your granddaddy lived. Your great granddaddy lived. And they'd be like, No, Dad, you can't make us walk both ways to school in the snow uphill. And I'd be like, I'll do it. I swear to God, I will. I'll call down the snow gods. And I'll make it snow every day before school. You have to walk your ass there. It won't snow on nobody else. I'm gonna psychologically <laughs> torture you, motherfuckers. 
Like, that's why I don't want kids, because I psychologically torture them little bastards. I'm about to start my own Twitter joint again, because I don't know my... I found the email, but that's that kiss the fish joint, AOL. And yeah. I don't know the I don't know the I don't know the combo for that joint. Uh, so that's why I changed my email. Yeah, well, you know, start yourself up a fresh, you know, a fresh you know, whatever. I got locked out trying to guess the combo. So. Yeah. I guess I could try it again later, maybe. But Elon gonna be like, nah. Now Hell you might risk, bro. you might be able to change your email address, but you know, let me like well, get I set up a new. Up. I set up another one. We'll get on that my sh- Google John or some shit like that. Get I guess, that shit apparently. fired up, yeah, man. And then you can uh, like, you can share the show on there, man. You got to like find the actual video, Mike. You got to find a video. Can't you, you like you shared the fucking comment the other day that I add sweet you Jane is sweet and add you do you on there. No, I thought that was the video I put on there. Yeah, Twitter's weird like that. You got to like, you got to get up to the origination of the thread and t- retweet that thing up there at the top. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's got to have the video underneath, and if that shit ain't got the green circle on it, then you didn't do it. You know what I'm saying? If the, if it ain't gotcha, the green gotcha, circle gotcha. under the video. But, yeah. Ain't no problem. You know, got to get y'all out there. Let's, like, rickety ship crews. Got to start retweeting the show. That would help. Because Twitter gets decent decent numbers sometimes. But I don't know if anybody's actually watching any of this shit. I don't really look at analytics too much. I don't have much expectation. I just like doing the show. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. yeah. I got you now. Then we're good to go. Just All right. enjoying got myself. That park set up. I'm just enjoying myself. Trying to get right. You got to, man. Fuck, life's too short. I was telling this, uh, uh-huh. telling uh, Ace Money uh, the other day when I was talking to her, she was like, you know, uh, ever since she, she thought that she wasn't going to be able to do things on her own, and she's like, you know what, I'll come to the conclusion that I can actually do things on my own and be good. I was like, well, yeah, it gives you uh, this, this certain peace to, to life. And she's like, you know, I'm starting to enjoy some things now. I was like, yeah, things feel better once you establish yourself and be like, all right, cool, I'm good to go. I can do this on my own. I'm straight. You know what I mean? Yeah, you got to remember to believe in yourself. Too many people are unwilling to actually, like, readily engage in the process and the thought that they can do something and and it'll come around at some point but there's also like the the gamble of this won't actually do anything like i might get good at this thing and it doesn't net me anything i'll just be good at it for my own personal sake like yeah like somebody that learns guitar when they're 50 they're not going to be pulling a bunch of 16 year old girls like if you learn guitar when you're 14 you're going to pull a bunch of 16-year-old girls when you're 16. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But when you're 50 and you learn guitar, you're just like, hey, look at that. I did something. You're not going to become a rock star. You're not going to be, you know, touring the world in your 20s and 30s. You know what I mean? You might you might catch some heat. You know, any, but anything's possible. But, like, you do stuff for yourself. You know? You All don't, right. you Check don't me do out. It. Sweet Jew Jane at 6 9 bro. Sweet Jew Jane at 6 9 At 6 9 Check that's me. in your name is at <laughs> that's in my that's like my twitter AT? jump the, sweet the, you jane at with the little six, a jump with the a circle jump wait a minute huh yo look him up mike you got twitter in front that's, of you I'm, i just opened it up to see if i can find him right now man. i got no followers and, and i ain't following shit y'all already know sweet jew jane right yeah one word sweet and then ju the j capital and ju and then the J capital and Jane. Okay, so I gotta put a capital in it now. So I'm putting the capital. I doubt the capital matters, but that's the way it's gonna look when you get to it. And then you said at. Yeah, with the circles on, like at AOL, kind of like that same at, bro. Okay, at six nine. Sweet Jew Jane at six nine. It says no results for Sweet Jew Jane at six nine. Take the at out. It's right here, bro. Well, because Sweet Jew Jane is what it was. Sweet Jane, but I can't use that again because that's still a person. All right? I can't yeah, use it the same name. Up. I got Sweet Jew Jane. Yeah, but I can't but access I that on my new jump because that's not me. I no, mean, you're, you're Hartle and DR. Oh, what the fuck? That's not cool. 22006. <laughs> There's another name that I changed so then. Hold on, what is it, Hartle? <laughs> no, hold on. That's not going to be that. <laughs> it's just that. <laughs> He's like, I don't know. You you didn't like something. I don't. I see what you're trying to do there. 
but you can't have an at in your name because you at at yourself. Yeah. Oh, well, then what the fuck? That's well, not something. Have... You can't have that. You'd have to do, literally, you'd have to spell out A-T. You'd have to do sweet Jew Jane at 6 9 or or just go by your fucking name that you use on Instagram or on Twitter. That would be you could be Jew Unit Six Nine. Jew Unit, yeah. But he wants, he, yeah. I don't know something about Sweet Jew Jane. I don't know why. Why do you use that name, <laughs> Sweet Jew Jane? Like, that's his pimp name, yo. That's his pimp name. Sweet Jew <laughs> Jane here. Yeah. Sweet Jew Jane. Man. He, he shows. Know- he shows up with the cane. Yeah. And he's like, Showing up with the cane, call me Sweet Jew Jane, baby. Hey, yeah, baby. I'm out here fishing all day. Sweet Jew Jane here in the house. Now go down the street and uh, get me some Cambodian and teddy milk. You Sweet Jew Jane in 69 the morning there, because, man. Right at AT. Capital Just AT. Sweet Jew Jane 69. Sweet Jew Jane 69, you could be too, probably, because there probably ain't no Sweet Jew Jane 69 out there. Yeah, look, I'm going to look it up now. This is makes just to see. Uh huh. Yeah, you could call me my pimp name, Sweet Jew Jane, and you could just put an 069 on there because you know what I'm saying. That's what I have yep. my pimp game. Sweet, Sweet Jew Jane is available. No, but that's. Oh, wait, you could change oh, it to. Wait, wait. Sweet Jew Jane 69. That's what I meant to put. 69. Sweet Jew Jane 69 <laughs> is available. <laughs> Watching the Jew trying to figure out technology is an amazing thing to behold I hate sometimes. This shit, man. man, I got to come up with passwords. <laughs> I got to put all these here things together and such. No. And then he's going to forget it here in fucking three days. Well, like, I've taken to setting up all of my shit inside of the password manager inside of the Apple phone. I just let it do yeah, it. I do the same shit with mine. Right, I'm but like, I know fuck he ain't. It. Fuck it. Just let it, Jew. Let it do that shit. Let it help you. I don't like to always let the AI help, but sometimes it's real helpful. And that password management shit is mad helpful, yo. Although it makes it tough to change a password sometimes. Mm-hmm. The thought. You can see I'm the looking at turning. some of Jews' old tweets here. Don't, don't became faded. Shade as a ghost of Haiti. You know, anyone safe would you, would you the Jew go crazy? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker, man. I don't even understand huh? that one. Huh? Is that his most recent tweet? Is Sweet Jew Jane? This this was an old. This is an old tweet from uh, I guess 2010, maybe. Well, but all the tweets are gonna be old because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying, this is one of them. Uh, here, here's another one. Dang a dang! Forgot about that Twitter about to to get what to get her. Trying to figure out something with that one-headed quitter. <laughs> I'm looking at it and I'm listening to you read it, and I'm like, "This is crazy." This uh, my man has 70 posts. Tweet. He did 70 posts. He did one too many. If he had posted 69 posts and then stopped, yeah. that would have been so amazing in French <laughs> show. Here he is at 69. One too many posts. Mm. This motherfucker back in the tweet. Sometimes my rhymes be sweet. Other, <laughs> other are dirty as feet. Don't get it complicated. <laughs> Infiltrated was de- what's delegated. <laughs> Infatuated <laughs> what's delegated. A pet boy, sweet J. <laughs> That's perfect, yo. Uh, <laughs> shit. This this motherfucker was fucking trying to spit rhymes on Twitter. Fuel getting kind of low. Got to put an order in for that sour diesel. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> this is stupid, yo. This is not helping me at all, man. Robots are going to take over the world because fucking with people always comes bullshit. My username is how y'all going to hit me, right? Yeah. Well, that's they, how, it's gonna saying act. Sweet Jew Jane ain't up in there, bro. Like, there's... Sweet Jew Jane, 6 er Username, be- oh, now we're good. Now we're good. Yeah, there's no result yet. You haven't made it official. Sweet Jane okay. 69 is not official yet. It will be shortly. <laughs> oh, no, wait a minute. Wait, listen to this one. 
Used and abused like a tampon on a road trip. <laughs> Fuck life, <laughs> not done with this shit. Used <laughs> and abused like a tampon. Hold on, on hold on. Trip? Fucking cowboys in Centerville. Fuck off. How can you milk a cow on a quarter acre farm? <laughs> 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 God damn it. There's been some good ones there's to Twitter, right? There's nothing but nothing nothing sane come out of that. But no yeah, nobody's seen this. <laughs> like my oh my why did my boy bring that apple pie shine? <laughs> oh this one. Oh where oh where can some strange be? Oh where oh where can it be? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this motherfucker's tweets alone, yeah, I can fuck with this shit. <laughs> mudgets, uh. mudgets, and mullets. Good old Charlestown. I think he meant midgets. Yeah. <laughs> aware, aware, can some strange be? Aware, aware, can it be? Uh, look, tried to pretty woman a stripper last night. Even going to throw her breakfast. But it is what it is, or was what it was. <laughs> <laughs> it's what it is, or was what it was. My hey, girl. Hey, you go, man. Power of a, a power of pussy will make you leave a N word <coughs> that road down to the spot with you. <laughs> you fucking idiot, man. That did that motherfucker left me in fucking Richmond and fucking dickheads, man. <laughs> That was a true story. Rode down to fucking Shaco Bottom with that black ass motherfucker and the bird. I left my goddamn whip in the bird. And that motherfucker left me, dog. The club closed. He was fucking in the parking lot, some fucking random ass where. And I was out on the street fucking looking for this motherfucker, trying to hide in the garage and shit. Police was like, look, if I see you again, dog, you're going to jail. I'm like, okay, I'm cab. Okay, cab ride from fucking Richmond back to Fredericksburg to my house in Bilton because it was my son's birthday that motherfucking morning. <laughs> so I will, so here I am knocking on the door. My it's still my house, but I ain't allowed to live there no more. You know what I mean? Because relationships suck. So like, hey, what's up? Where's your where the fuck is your car, bitch? I don't want to talk about it. Like, let me start fucking cooking. Nah, nope. We're not doing it. We're not doing it. So did the birthday party. The old boy finally hit me up. But like, or he called me when I got the bill. And was like, where you at, bro? And I'm like, bro, this is two and a half hours motherfucking later, dog. What are you talking about? Where am I at? Not in jail. My two options. Get a $400 cab ride or go to jail, dog. I took the cab <laughs> ride, motherfucker. Because you had my keys any fucking way. So it couldn't go to my car. You know what I mean? And just, what, sit there until you came fuck home whenever the fuck you felt like it? Like, I ain't got shit to do, bro. Like, this is already 2 or 3 in the morning already, good, you know what I'm saying? Good on you taking the wise move and taking the Uber, taking the taxi, <laughs> getting home. Good on you. I'm sorry. I just read another one that got me. KFC mashed potatoes are hitting it from the back. It's how you turn uh -huh. the flat-ass bitches into full-ass beauties. <laughs> This motherfucker! <laughs> hey, hold on, hold on. If the earth had a nipple, the atmosphere and chi and earth would be super high on the happy meter. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck does that even mean? He what? don't even know. He's just shaking his head. You're right. You like, he's shaking his head like he has no idea what to say about what that means. Uh. <laughs> Look. I told y'all Twitter was a time, bro. He, there was a time in your life. You tweeted 70 tweets. There was a time in your life. Yeah, there man. was. <laughs> and they were phenomenal, bro. And they was fucking phenomenal, cuz. And there's zero likes. Nobody liked a damn why, one of them. Why does Punani call so much when dick is free? I'm starting to pussy protest. <laughs> Yeah, he, hold on. Multi talented. That's a good one right there. That is a good one right yeah. there. Multi talented. Just cut my hair while taking a shit. Hells yeah. Just cut my hair while taking a shit. God damn it. This motherfucker's stupid, yo. That's easier than catching crabs at a whorehouse. <laughs> Got some killer bubble guts releasing pressure that can move water. <laughs> Oh, that one. Uh, uh, 
Abraham Lincoln was a good man, hopped out the truck with his dick in his hand, and said, hey, little cutie, drop your drawers and give me some booty. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it, man. <laughs> it's too much. Uh, yeah, bro, you're a ridiculous person. It's a good thing. It, it is too much. It keeps you interesting. I don't know. It keeps us entertained anyway. All right, there I am. I'm in the game at Sweet. At Sweet G Jane 6 9. Well, good on you, Mr. Unit. So there oh, you go. If you're, if you're a rickety ship crew member, follow at Sweet G Jane 6 9. Sweet G right, Jane. And go. Everything, if you know how to spell the Jew, it's spelled the way you would expect it to be spelled. If, if he's going to play the game right, he will uh, share the podcast videos. You said ask Sweet Jujane69, right? Yeah. Got one yeah, following still, already. Still can't, still can't find you. One follower already. Look at this dude. Sweet Jujane69. Not yeah. at. Yeah, I don't see it. That's a. Uh... Ah, here we go. He got the cake as his thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Alright, so how uh, do you, there we go. How do you uh now go to you. go to at Mason and Friends <clears throat> and follow this that motherfucker here. And then share some of the videos. Don't share them all, all at the same time like Mike's dumbass did. <laughs> yeah, I went through that motherfucker yeah. and started hitting them. Spread them out. Go back as far as you can. Share some shit. No, wait a day or two. Go back as far as you can. Say, share some shit you haven't shared. You know what I'm saying? Spread it out. You got to rebump it to the front. You know what I mean? It's like cocaine. You can't just go and bump it all at the same time. That overdose, like that it overdose, like Mike overdosed on that shit. Mike's <laughs> Twitter account. He hit it too hard. Uh, 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 these 70 fucking goddamn tweets from his original shit, though, or something else. Yeah, you could go retweet yourself. Your old D yeah. Sweet Ju Jane account, you could retweet those onto your new one. Because it does still exist. We was just reading them all off to you. <laughs> Bitch, you know what I want? I, I want to <laughs> talk to some to Samson. <laughs> <laughs> The Jew was 10 years ahead of his time. Talking on there, talking about Samson. Where are you? How you? Uh, how do I post that junk on my junk or whatever? You see the little circle underneath the tweet? Like, if you go to see the video, there's, uh, there's different things. And there's, like, an arrow working in a circle. Yeah. That's the retweet. It says repost? There's, like, two. Quote? Yeah, two arrows. Exactly. It's to repost it. On, from your account so you would like just hit the video yeah little tutorial ladies and gentlemen on Twitter uh, say well look I X. gotta get ready to jump off here y'all word up Mike well thank you for doing what we can with this I think I finally figured out some better audio tweaks cause mm -hmm. I'm a bit of an idiot and, uh, bet, bet. So look, I'm gonna holler. I'm gonna go ahead and jump off of this, and y'all be easy to everybody out there, little bits by little bits. And uh, I'll see y'all next go round. Amen to that. All right, well, peace right, be so with you, I'll dude. I'll holler at y'all. Right. Peace. Yep, yep. Peace. He's gone. And there goes Mike. And there I am, video on video, looking at myself on video, looking at myself on video. That's some tripped out shit. I'm gonna have to put that on there. Looking at me, looking at myself, looking at myself, looking at myself. You see that? Oh, wait, because you're on the on your you're I'm still on, on the jump on the zoom. I'm, right, I'm on the zoom weave. <laughs> like Mike, the mic clocked out, and yeah, I'm just so that's your big face. It's your whole face on that Joe. Then it's yeah, well, screen, right? it's actually not all just my face. I could twist it now, probably get my whole face. See, so look at that. Now that I'm on there all the way myself, looking at myself, looking at myself, well lit behind myself. This is myself talking to myself and looking at myself. Looking at myself. I'm looking. Let me see if I could zoom in on myself. 
looking at myself. Yeah, look at that. Madness. Oh, that's a little bit of craziness. <laughs> yes, yes it is. Crazy. Crazy, I tell you. All right, that's as close as I can get without it going fuzzy, at least fuzzy from what I can see. I guess I'll close this Zoom meeting. Now it's back to just the two of us, Mr. Unit. You know how it always be doing? That just always boils back to us at some point. <coughs> Man, tweaking on that audio was a trip. I was working on the wrong one half the There's time. There's a little bit of shit going on with it. Um, yeah, that, I don't know. We're moving I mean, in the right direction. That fucking, that new router I got right there was supposed to hold like 30 devices, cover like three rooms or some stupid shit like that, but I don't know. Well, it seemed to do pretty good. I think that the problem with uh, like your your stream thing is multifold. You yeah, know you're also mean? streaming. I mean, you got the boys fucking Wi-Fi and we Wi-Fi. And, you know, yeah. I mean, you got a lot of shit going on with yeah. it right now. So there's a lot of going on. What I still want to do is get my own uh, Starlink. If I if I get to where I'm a little straighter on money, I might cop a Starlink that's like mobile and just carry it around with me, set it up at the on the What's porch. Like internet or something? Yeah, that's the uh, Elon Musk low low uh, low Earth orbit satellite internet company. Portable Wi-Fi. Essentially, yeah. You can put it on like the top of your Walkman RV. Wi-Fi. He got Walkman <laughs> Wi-Fi going on there. I don't know if it's quite Walkman <laughs> level. Like that's, that's not going to be at Walkman that's, level, bro. That's, that's what classic. I, that's what I want, dog. <laughs> I want Wi-Fi level Walkman style where I like just the way I'm seeing it is if I bring it like to work, right? I just plug it up. I've got my little Starlink outside. I set it up. When I get there, I take it when I leave. I set Shouldn't it up. Be, when uh, I'm no at bigger home. than a pager. So, well, like the, essentially, the thing is like maybe something that would fit in like one of my briefcases, right? God you know? damn. Yeah, that's I mean, what you it think looked it like. Would be, it had to be that big. I mean, a router and a modem is, you know, what I mean, like should be no bigger than that. I don't fucking know. Different technology, so uh -huh. <clears throat> Elon technology. Yeah, technology's a real, a real fuck of it all. Uh huh. But, I don't know, dude. Life's not so bad. Things Man. are coming along. We'll see. Little complaints. More than more than needed. Yeah, it's not bad. It ain't been too bad. Things ain't Sucks so finding bad. a fucking car there, man. I looked at some beaters, man. I drove all the way to fucking Springfield, man. This goddamn... You still in that $5, five, five grand range? Five grand, yeah. I've moved it up to six, but it ain't doing no different. It ain't helping out. Like I said, that car I looked at, was they wanted five for it fucking had a hole in the fucking driver's floor like pushed my hand down and felt water down on the fucking in a in a fucking mat right? you want a you want an 04 rav4 because it's not quite as cheap as you want but the dealer i work at has well one of the other dealers i work at that's in the group that i work for he had like i saw you wanted had i think it was, it was like 46 36 56 very low miles with a five speed just a rav4 they were asking like nine grand, and I'm like, that's a lot of money, but that's Shit, not a not bad really not buy. for fifty on it though. That's what I'm saying. You know it was I mean? under fifty. Unless they burnt the clutch up or something, right. you know what I mean? You gotta go out right. there and it was an O four Yoda with under fifty, and your yeah. taxes are gonna be low on that. Low that's fuck, low yeah. miles, low. Well, I mean, like, I thought that's small though, man. That's another thing. That's small. I got yeah. I, when I get these two lengthy ass motherfuckers anywhere mm. in that goddamn thing, you touché. know what I mean? Touche, touche. That's the bad part about that. No, that's a good point. I didn't even think of that. Like, but you, yeah, because that's a small. Because that's the old school shit. My mom had one of them motherfuckers, yeah. and they ain't really nice ass car. But right. I mean, that's what I thought. I was like, I was miles, like, that's sure. a good buy for somebody that needs a car that can drive it a long ways. And and that's what I thought is like, you maintain that bitch, it'll go three four hundred thousand miles if you keep it. I'd out of fuck the around and buy that and get rid of the truck. But then I'll still need a go-to car, you know what I mean? For well, you could go to that until you paid it off, if you wanted, and then cop something else. Because it's like one of the, there's, I don't see a lot of good buys. No, and, there's not at all. Like I said, these fucking tone, they had a hole in the fucking floorboard. Right. The tone I was looking at, it cut, I couldn't even test drive it when I got there. Dude was like, we just inspected it, and it's got this dead inspection on it. Talking about steering. And headlights and shit like that. Yeah, like he's bro. like, you can't even drive. Yeah, he's like, I can't even. We're not even selling this car. It needs so much work. I'm like, yeah, motherfuckers, man. God damn. Then I drove over there to fucking Fredericksburg. This nice ass looking 06 Max. 
and at, at this fucking public auction. Man, that motherfucking car been there since at least 2020. Shit was sitting on the rims, fucking Oof. no coolant in the goddamn junk. The door ain't fucking closed. The fucking roof latch was gone. Dude was holding the hood up with his head. Trying to jump start it with the fucking jump box and shit, right? <laughs> fucking muffler was fucking. Someone was loose somewhere down in that muffler. Just, wah, 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 wah. I'm like, uh, new tires, new muffler. Anything else to get inspected? Five grand? Like, what the fuck are you talking about, dog? Yeah, like, dude, I'm telling you, like, cash for clunkers destroyed it for everybody. The, the industry. It's fucking ridiculous, man. The like, industry commands crazy prices. Like, you're fucked if you're trying to look for anything under 10 grand. Uh-huh. And even 10 grand, you're not really going to get what you get unless you find just that one grandma that got that regal that she just yeah. takes to the store. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. In that one community, there, dude, <laughs> but you and, gotta buy that one bitch. Those, you know those cars mean? are out there. They're but you, out there, you but gotta be. You gotta be able to be patient for them. And you gotta and you gotta buy them when you see the motherfuckers. Right, right. You can't well, let them go by. That's like what happened with the vet. Like I just, it, it just happened to show up. It was like the kind of car I've always been looking for, and it showed up exactly like what I wanted. And I was like, I got to, I, yeah. I, I gotta try to buy this. I can swing this. This doesn't show up on a regular basis, and then like nothing like it has shown up since. And I, you know, I always look at the stuff. That's how I knew about that one. I'm like, oh, well, that's, that's not a bad buy for somebody. Yeah. Like, that's the best buy I've seen. Like, because I always note when I see something and I go, you know what? That's more money than I'd like to spend on that. But in today's market, it's this day it. and age, that is a great yeah. fucking buy. And it's, you know, it's a sad state of affairs, man. Yeah, it's terrible. Like I said, I'm looking at... I'm looking at Corolla's fucking two hundred and thirty thousand miles on it for fucking four grand. Oh yeah. Oh five. All day. All day. Oh five. Like two shit. They look decent on the out. Well, the Clapped. pictures. I mean, they look decent, but Clapped it's like, yo, out. what the fuck? I just bought that that Camry that I had. I bought that. I think in uh, three years ago. I think I bought that bitch, and I paid forty five out out straight out for it, and had one thirty on it. I think. Yeah, one thirty on it. Fucking yeah, man, it's out of control. And then fucking Lisa hit me with the blue books and all this shit, or the like the JD Power Jump. They want like three grand for anything I've looked at. Yeah, at least. And they're like fifty-five, five thousand. Like, what the fuck? Y'all need to make that much on some bullshit ass car? Like, it's dealership. It's this the is like market. A, this is like Nissan. You it's know what I mean? She. It's the market. They, yeah, I know it's fucked. It's the market. It's fucked. Like I, I don't even know. I'm gonna have to almost. That's why I keep I'm saying... I'm at the point now where I'm going to have to buy like a fucking thousand dollar fucking cash beater. For, that's why I'm saying cash for clunkers did nothing but hurt poor Fucked people. Fucked it up. I need like, to buy like a thousand dollar clunker and, and hopefully it lasts. And for a little bit because I can't keep fucking with the truck. See, I got something going on with that Jones either. Motor mount or something. That Jones be making some kind of like knock just randomly. Hey man, they come apart, cars. It's not like in the apart. engine or nothing like that. Yeah. It's like over here. It's either that or in the... Tie rod or, yeah, dude, something or something or something. That truck is beat to shit. It's 2000. That shit, that shit was sitting in my boy's yard for fucking two and a half years, getting trees and gr- grass growing out through that motherfucker and shit. You know what I mean, I changed oil, did the fucking antifreeze. Uh-huh. Oh, you got your money out of it. Shit and drove that motherfucker right down the fucking road. You You're know what I mean? You're getting your money out of it for sure. It's like, fuck, man. That thing is a beast. I don't even know how you got it here with the grounds was all fucked up on it when we fixed them. I don't know how it ever ran. Yeah, that jump been. But, you know, hey, it is what it is. So that motherfucker been a soldier, man. Like, fuck. Uh-huh. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you have a cheap car, hit up the Jew unit, um, cause he's looking. I'm almost at the point where I really, where I'm about to go take it up to like dude, that dude that I know. Well, I don't know, but Jimmy knows he fucked with his shit and be like, look at this, look this shit over, bro. Like, if I put three grand in this motherfucker for a whole tranny and a fucking motor. What other kind of dumb shit does do we really need to work with all, to make this shit reasonable? All your suspension bushings, you'd need. If I were you, I'd replace all my control arms and shit. I would think suspension so. Suspension yeah. bushings, At least. control arms, whatever. Then, ain't none of that shit been fucked with. Right, springs, spring mounts, shocks. I would do all that stuff. I know the back shocks are probably still decent. What shocks go for? Fucking there? is it miles or well, years? But that sort of thing. If you really, like, if you get me to get you parts or something, we could probably get you all the parts you need for, like, four, five, six hundred bucks as far as, like, suspension is concerned. Just, you would, you know, it would all be new stuff. You'd have to find somebody to replace all that stuff with, with fresh, 
aftermarket, not original pieces. Yeah. But I would bet you your struts, we could probably get you struts for 45 bucks a piece. You know what I mean? You get four, that's $180. You know what I mean? That's not a lot of money. You got four struts, you know, maybe you reuse the springs. You get some new mounts for this or that. Like, I don't know how many components there are The only thing I trust is the rear shocks because I put those in probably like two or three years ago. Oh, well, then And those... I ain't really put much use on the back. You yeah, know what well, I mean? There those, going on. Those would probably be fine, sure. That's the only but thing that I really replace. Like the that front, shit. though? Like, if I were you, I would replace it would all need the everything suspension in the front. Yeah, the everything front. in the front would need to be swapped out because yeah. I'm sure it ain't been fucked for less. Like, and you might, you might need a steering rack the way everything t- you talk about it as far as its status the way state of that vehicle but yeah that's right that's almost where i'm at the point now because it's like what do i want to buy a five thousand dollar fucking basically junker because the market's so fucked up or do i want to put three thousand dollars in this half-ass junker i got right now already in the yard knowing it's going to get me everywhere i need to go well because you know what you got yeah because i know what i got And the engine and the tranny, I'm sure nowadays I probably, well, now it's, I could have got it for 15 but now probably they want almost 17 or 18 now probably with the market and all that well, dumb shit. Well, maybe. maybe. I mean, maybe figure, cheaper, maybe. figure you get all you need to do a full engine and transmission swap for around two grand because it's not just the engine and the transmission. Yeah, it's the work, too. There's going to be other pieces. There's going to be work. You know, Works gonna be too bad though, technically, because the compressor ain't in there. So well, you got you, the truck is wide the fuck open. It ain't much bolt and pull that shit out. You don't have none of that well, but shit. That, you know that's I mean? that's the thing. But you know, you, there's gonna be other pieces to make sure that this yeah, thing goes in and too, works yeah. well for the long haul and is actually worth the investment of dropping in a trans and engine. Because if you bought like an engine and trans that is together and complete low miles out of Japan from a JDM importer, and you had someone install it in that uh, truck. You, That's sh- I'm at, you yeah. should theoretically have a really solid vehicle outside of the beat to shit condition that the rest yeah. of the vehicle is just in. Just surprise, just as long as it's the stuff that and makes it, the, the stuff that front, makes yeah. it drive and and turn and sh- that should be pretty good. The structural integrity of it, eh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't but know I ain't, do, well I ain't making much noise with it. You know what I mean? It's not like as long as you don't drive it like here. as long as you drive drive it like you drive cars, like it'll probably be all right. But if you drive it like you drive vehicles, you might you still might destroy it from pushing it real hard with your nice fresh new motor. Yeah, maybe. You know what I mean? So well, she's still scooted at eight eighty five going down six six. I try to keep it at like seventy seventy five, but so I get so run you over. Keep it. You keep it <laughs> fresh. Over, you, you know? Yeah, if you can keep it fresh, <laughs> running eighty miles an hour. And not falling apart under you, and not go pushing it through too many turns too hard, because those trucks they handle pretty good. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a decent truck. They don't ass handle truck, bad yeah. at all. No, nah, like, that's a decent ass like truck. My couple of year older variant is a really good handling vehicle. For yeah, most of that, like there's probably not like solid ten year stretch where those are solid ass whips. Yeah, they're great vehicles. So, like, 90s and the early 2000s mm-hmm. Nissans had a lot. Yeah, hell yeah, Nissans were one fucking round. But uh, ladies and gentlemen, with that said. We're going to have to bring this episode of the Mason and Friends show to a close. We would like to thank you so very much for listening. We'd like to encourage you to listen to old episodes as well as new episodes. Like, share, subscribe. Don't bogart this bitch. Tell your peoples about this motherfucker. Um, you know, be nice people that look like you. Be nice people that don't look like you. Don't be a dick. Uh, keep grinding on the shit you're trying to get done because that is how things get done. And uh, don't forget just how much we love you. And peace be with you. Peace.